Hello everyone. How are you all doing today? I hope you are all doing good from wherever you are watching this video from. I am personally doing good from my end and I want to welcome each and every one of you to our YouTube channel. If you are new here kindly, remember to subscribe to this channel and also turn on the notification bell so that every time we have a new video, you will be able to get notified. For our returning subscribers, welcome back and thank you for your support. Thank you for always being here, basically supporting our content and mostly we are here to look into Harry and Meghan's endeavors and I basically come here to just celebrate whatever Harry and Meghan have shared with us and also protect them against the hate and all these smear campaign against the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. My people, in this specific video, I am here to share something so special and it's something revolving around Invictus Games Foundation. My people, whenever I speak of Invictus Games, definitely it's something that touches most of us basically because Harry did this to help those in need, the injured veterans. And that is what makes Invictus Games sound so special because it is truly a special game. Invictus Games Foundation is yet to begin as from february next year and by that it doesn't mean that next year is so far away we are almost there we are three months away from it and invictus games will actually be in canada as from february so i can't wait for that event but now before that we have some preparation definitely and i'm here to inform you of invictus games foundation making historic visits to ukraine yes as i have said the invictus games foundation recently marked a significant milestone with its official visits to ukraine and a proud member of invictus community of nations since 2017, that is Ukraine. This momentous occasion was met with overwhelming gratitude from the Ukraine hosts who expressed their delight in, in welcoming the foundation's delegation. And I just feel so special sharing with, with you this kind of story because Invictus Games is something that Harry has truly worked for and having these games throughout the world is something so special. So Ukraine is one of these community and my people, I'm so happy the way they welcomed Invictus Games Foundation to their country. And during this landmark visit, Representatives from the Invictus Games had the unique opportunity to engage directly with the national team of Ukraine and gaining valuable insights into their ongoing preparation for the upcoming event. As I have said, it is beginning as of early February 2025 in Canada. Despite the challenges that are ongoing in Ukraine, the ongoing war in that homeland, they have managed to show their unwavering commitment to training and readiness towards the upcoming games. It's not that easy. Having learned that Ukraine is under some tension, definitely because of the war that is ongoing, imagine Team Ukraine are preparing for the Invictus Games next year. They are actually showing their commitment to that. And we must celebrate them in every way possible. Invictus community is something that is so special and it, re it really deserves respect in whatever way. So marking the beginning of this inspiring journey in 2017, Ukraine 
are so proud to have joined the Invictus community of nation. And this actually shows how much people are touched by the Invictus Foundation. Harry did an amazing thing in founding these particular games. And my people, the nation's representatives expressed their heartfelt appreciation, stating that we were incredibly proud and happy to welcome the delegation from the foundation to our country. That is from the representatives of that nation. This visit not only symbolized Ukraine's integration into the Invictus family, but also provided a valuable opportunity for the foundation's representatives to engage directly with the Ukraine national team and to gain first-hand insights into their preparation process even as they face challenges by the ongoing conflict in their country. That was so historic, by the way, it is an amazing thing. And Ukraine have actually shown us how they embrace the Invictus spirits. Ukraine is so thrilled to join this esteemed Invictus community of nations. That means they are embracing the Invictus spirit, which is something positive and it is commendable. The Invictus Games represent an extraordinary opportunity for our nation to showcase their indomitable spirit of wounded, injured, and sick service personnel and veterans. And imagine the Ukraine are so proud and happy to welcome the delegation from the Invictus Games Foundation to their country. A visit that underscores the importance of this global movement in supporting our own heroes. My people, that is the update I came here to inform you of because recently we had Harry making that virtual meeting with the NATO organization and, you know, it was something so special, definitely it was something close, surrounding Invictus Games anyway. That is basically what Harry had during that meeting. And thereafter, you have seen Invictus Games Foundation in Ukraine. Despite the challenges in the country, they have made to visit Ukraine and to see how far they are in terms of preparation for next year's Games. That is basically what we had to share today. Maybe you comment on whatever you think about Ukraine joining this big family. Just say something about it and it will be so amazing. Thank you so much for watching up to this point. Remember to subscribe, like, and also share the link with your friends and family. Until next time, goodbye.